As regards to whether I'm happy, it's it's like being paid to, to do your hobby and to, to go and have fun. It's it's like, you know, boys' toys, really. Space, the final frontier, Star Trek, all that. I grew up on Star Trek, so for me, this is, every day is fun. I'm floating, doing a few flips, just waiting to see the lunar eclipse. If you're looking for a Mars, turn left at the moon, just follow the stars and I'll see you soon. What? S to the P, A, C to the E, there's space in my space, so come and join me in the Milky Way. That's where you find me. Sent me to a science camp at the RDS, and I remember one day we went. We walked from the RDS to UCD Physics, and somebody there in physics did a demonstration of uh, levitation with liquid nitrogen and a superconducting magnet. And that for me was, if I ever had a moment where I thought science was cool, that was the moment. And any time any communication got a satellite connection to you sensations like a sci-fi movie. But don't tell my wife by because I told her I wouldn't have Wi-Fi, Julie. We're all about that space, about that space. You're a spacer. We're all about that space. About I enjoy space. being involved in everything, being able to see that even though we might only be working on a small part on the spacecraft, that it, it builds up and that bit has to be right in order for the next bit to be right and it, it kind of flows, the whole thing flows together so it's nice to be involved at every level. We're all about that space, about that space. But I never want to leave. Half in the sun, ready to take flight but I still can't race the speed of light and then cruise through space in my six fold doing a dry bike on a meteor. Nah, space will be more uh, like a I realised, I suppose, when I was about 11 or 12 that uh, science was what really interested me and I went to the library one day and I decided to work al alphabetically through all the sciences and I started with A for astronomy and uh, the first book I, I read on astronomy was by Patrick Moore and this really blew me away. I was totally uh, absorbed by this and uh, I realised then that uh, this was something I wanted to do. No air, so no waves, or say waves, and travel just rocks and dust and stones and gravel up there. It's so silent, can't hear anybody screaming, no violence. The stars don't tweak in the space without air, we're hitting you a fax about the atmosphere. We know a lot because we're intergalactic. I started working on public outreach and education and I discovered that most of the people have no idea about astronomy. They don't have basic science literacy. Rings, then the jewelers, they say, what does water, there's life. So are aliens getting on Mercury's life. We're all about the space, about the space. You're a spacer. We're all about the space, about the space. I was working on um, radar systems, actually. And we were, we were doing a contract for the Japanese Space Agency looking at how radar uh, systems could be used for applications. And somebody from the European Space Agency saw what I was doing and asked me to go and work there. The best advice is to study hard, uh, to be focused and concentrated just in the initial uh, years to say I'm, I, I, I want and I think that technology is a good career. If you want something then you better wish it a day on Venus is longer than a day in your life if you take a time to wish it might. To be a space in, in companies in space there's the space for everybody. There's a cost, there's admin, there's the sales, marketing. You know, there's, there's, there's places in, in the company for anyone with any skill set if they're interested. Get a lot of work experience, do a lot of different, you know, adopt new technologies, try and test out new ideas. Don't stay in your comfort zone for too long. Exploring is in our nature, so anybody can be a spacer. We're all about the space, about the space. You're a spacer. Determination would be the biggest skill, is just not, not letting it stop. Keep going, keep going. No matter what happens, you just keep going. We're all about the space, about the space. Hey. Space. Hey. But I never want to leave.